The entire MLB fears the Texas Rangers right now, and it is for good reason. After coming off another disappointing season where the Rangers finished fourth with only 68 wins, they have absolutely exploded onto the scene this year. At the time of recording this video, the Texas Rangers are leading their division and have a dominant record of 40 and 20, which is second best in the MLB. The Rangers have improved in a lot of areas, but there is one thing specifically that they are doing so much better than everybody else is. and when you hear what it is you might be scared of them as well what's up guys and welcome back to the channel in this video we're going to discuss the meteoric rise of the texas rangers this year and talk about how they've had so much success before we do i encourage you guys to answer this question in the comments which team right now today would you be most scared to face in a seven game series honestly folks texas is getting up there for me all right guys let's get into the video so before we address that one thing that texas is just so incredible at we need to go back Back to the offseason. The Rangers have been very busy the last two offseasons, spending boatloads of money and bringing in tons of talent on their team. In the last two years alone, they brought in guys like Jacob deGrom, Nathan Avaldi, Marcus Simeon, Corey Seager, Martin Perez, and that's just to name a few. They have spent hundreds of millions of dollars to build their team up, and unlike the New York Mets, sorry Mets fans, I know this stings, but Texas spending is actually working. So obviously they've invested heavily into their ball team to at least build a base for success. But I don't actually think it's these off-season acquisitions that have made them one of MLB's most feared teams. There's actually something deeper going on here. When we go over to look at team statistics in the MLB, it becomes abundantly obvious that the Texas Rangers are pretty good at offense. They are first in batting average, first in on base, and second in team OPS. Yeah pretty good. But believe it or not, even that doesn't tell the full story of how they've been so dominant. Because they're actually way better than that when it really matters. Potentially the most important statistic in all of baseball is batting average with runners in scoring position. How often do you come clutch when your team really needs it? If you're the Texas Rangers, the answer is a lot. The Rangers have a batting average with runners in scoring position of 337 right now. That is just miles above anyone else. In fact, all of their statistics are. These guys have an OPS of 939 with runners in scoring position, which is over 100 points higher than the next team. Simply put, when a runner gets into scoring position, all of the Texas Rangers hitters become MVP candidates. Take Adolis Garcia, for instance. The guy's batting 273 on the season and has a pretty decent slash line on the year. But with runners in scoring position, his batting average skyrockets and now, all of a sudden, he's hitting 359 with an OPS of almost 1.1. The dude literally becomes the best hitter in baseball the second someone gets in the scoring position. Basically, folks, the Texas Rangers offense is absolutely lethal right now, and if this continues you're gonna see them go very far. But guys, let me know what you think about all this in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you next time.